Hi, my name is Elizabeth McAdams, and I'm a potter here in Floyd, Virginia. Um, a little bit about myself, I grew up in Eflin, North Carolina, on my family's farm. Uh, then I went to school at UNC Wilmington in North Carolina and majored in studio art and minored in art history. And that's kind of where I got my ceramic background from. I took a few ceramics classes there. Um, I was also doing more painting and drawing then. Um, but after I graduated college, um, I became a floral designer and lived in Wilmington. And then I started taking uh, some ceramic classes at a community art studio there. And that kind of launched my uh, wanting to do more with pottery. And after that, um, I decided to pursue pottery further, and I did a wood firing residency at Cub Creek Foundation in Appomattox, Virginia, under John Jessamine. Um, and then I also did a summer workshop at where I was a studio assistant at Sugar Maples in Maple Crest, New York. Um, and then for the past two years, I did an apprenticeship with Sylvie Granatelli, a potter here in Floyd, Virginia, that really helped jumpstart my pottery career. Um, and I now have a studio space here at the Floyd Center for the Arts, and I'm the new studio manager of the Pottery Center. Um, so one thing I really enjoy about clay is that you can make functional work that's also uh, beautiful, but you can also use it and enjoy using it. And I really love the different um, aspects of the process where you're throwing on the wheel and then you're adding clay and making designs. Um, and then there's also, you know, you bisque fire and then you glaze the work and continue through the process. Um, one thing about being a potter is that you really have to learn to accept failure and just uh, move on from that. You know, some pieces you make aren't going to make it through the kiln, so it's a very humbling experience uh, through the whole process. And that's part of the beauty of making uh, work that can be used, uh, but it can also be broken. So I think the fragility of it uh, really makes it a beautiful thing.